Welcome back. Blue Point Brewing Company will debut its patriotic, uh, patriotic themed beer in honor of the first presidential debate at Hofstra University tonight. The Long Island Brewery is recreating an ale based on George Washington's original 1757 recipe. Joining me right now, Blue Point Brewery founder Mark Burford and Blue Point Brewery president Todd Osmond. Good to see you both. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. Thank you so much. So here's, here's the beer. How does it differ? this new recipe from what you're brewing every day at Blue Point? Well, the, the ingredients from back then in the 1750s were very different than the ingredients today. And so this is an authentic replication of what George did back then. So it's Washington Ale. Tell us about it. What, what's different about it? Uh, well, we used, uh, it's, it's lower in alcohol. So back in the day, they used uh, beer as a nutrition uh, element for the troops. Oh. Uh, so it's 3.3% alcohol by volume. But we also have some interesting ingredients like spruce tips, uh, which add a little bit of citrus and uh, a little more flavor to it, to the beer. And you said during the commercial break that it's, it's a lot of the things that they had on the farm. Right. They, they used the ingredients they had as opposed to now we order whatever we want. Right. But back then, oats, corn, in addition to the barley and molasses were a part of the, the recipe. I love it. Where'd you find this recipe uh, for this new flavor, Washington Ale? It's uh, in the New York Public Library, actually, on display. Anybody can come by and take a look at it. Now, the words are written, obviously, the language is slightly different than we're used to today. So it's not easily to read or convert, and the brewers had to do a lot of research to convert it to a new technology that we have today. That's fascinating that you got the recipe in, in, in the library. Yeah, that's uh, a lot of homebrewers over the years requested it, and beer brings people together. So it's one of those things that's uh, across all boundaries. I love it. So you had the recipe down. How did you become involved with the debate? Uh, so we were asked actually to make a beer for the debate, uh, and we'd been thinking about this for a while. There's a tavern down the street from the brewery. It's not there anymore, but George Washington visited visited it after he was uh, president, and uh, that sort of inspired us. So it was an easy ask for us. So how much of this ale do you plan to sell after the debate? I mean, it's interesting because it is lower alcohol level. It's different, it's different ingredients uh, and a different taste. Yeah, well, I hope it's really delicious. I hope everybody gets a chance to taste it. We're looking for a nice release, metro area. Election day should be the day it gets out. It's available in the tasting room in Blue Point, too, so anybody can come visit us in Patchogue mm. and uh, get a taste of it. Is it more expensive to produce this than the beer that you always produce, since these are different, uh, different ingredients, maybe in some cases harder to get? Uh, not really. Uh, when it it's comes not more down expensive. to it. Spruce tips aren't easy to come by, but it's, it's pretty much the same. Um, so, in, in, so it's not m any more costly than making your, your regular flavors? No, it is not. Yeah. Okay, what kind of a reception have you gotten? Uh, so far, we've only tested it internally, and uh, <laughs> employees and brewers love it. We'll see what happens uh, when we bring it to the public and decide if we want to keep going with it. So where will it be tonight, uh, relatively speaking, in the debate? It'll be in the hospitality tent, mm -hmm. uh, so the general public can't get it, but you'll, you'll be able to come by and try it. That is terrific. And how long does it take to brew? Oh, it's about two weeks to three weeks from start to finish, and we've got the first batch in the bottle, as you see, and we're looking to make more when it's time to release. That is awesome. Mark Todd, great to see you. Thanks so much. Congratulations. Thank you very much. We appreciate it, and uh, we will uh, check it out, a Blue Point Brewery there.